I'm in the little town of Yelling today in Denmark, and this stone right in front of us here is one of the most important monuments in the country. It's called the Yelling Stone. Actually, there are two. There's this one and this one here. This one, though, is very important for a number of reasons. It was erected in the mid-10th century by King Harold Gormson. His nickname was Harold Bluetooth. And he erected this in memory of his parents, who were Gorm the Old and Thura, his uh, his mother, and he erected it for uh, two specific reasons. One was to show his conquests, uh, his ability to um, unite all of the rival factions and warring tribes in what's today Denmark and Norway and parts of Sweden, and secondly to show that he converted the the population to Christianity, or he, in any case, made Christianity the official religion of uh, the realm. And so I like to think he's something like the Emperor Constantine from uh, 4th century, uh, the 4th century Roman Empire. So here on this side, you've got, it's very, very difficult to see, but I'll show you a picture of it. You've got the first image of Christ in all of Scandinavia. And in fact, this image here is inside the Danish passports. Then over here, there's an animal, some kind of an animal being uh, sort of intertwined with uh, maybe a tree. We don't really know. And then the other side is the most of the text in rune saying that Harold dedicated this to his father and mother. Uh, and also saying that he um, was he managed to conquer all of Denmark and Norway. It's more rune down there that's saying about Norway, and then make the Danes um, Christian. And there's some writing that's just barely visible down there that attests to this fact. So this is one of the two monuments rune stones here in Yelling in Denmark.